What's good everybody? This is officially the second video of the channel. This video is gonna be a vlog of Dental School Acceptance Day 2020. I'm gonna be doing a vlog and a live reaction to my acceptances or rejections. So acceptance day is usually around December 1st or 2nd, but due to COVID, it got pushed back two weeks. So acceptance day is the 15th this year, and today is the 14th, so it's the day before acceptance day. One of my friends sent me a post on Reddit, and it was pretty much all the dental schools and around what time that they usually send out acceptances and whether they call or use email. I'll be sure to put the Reddit link below in the description. I know Texas schools usually send emails around midnight or so. So I'll have my camera set up and I'll just be looking at my computer. I got two interviews to two out of state schools. So one of them calls at 4.30 in the morning, which I'm unsure why. And the other one calls around 9 a.m. So Looking forward to that. We have to get up pretty early for the 431. I'm currently about to do a photo shoot with a friend. He hit me up. He, I'm guessing he wants to practice with his camera. So I'm here, I'm dressed. So today's just gonna be really chill. Once I'm done here, I'm gonna unwind, go home and just relax and wait for the big day. And yeah, I'm about to go do this photo shoot, so. All right, y'all, I'm back. We just finished the photo shoot. I had to take my hair out the bun. My hair is kind of crazy right now. It's not sitting down right. It's kind of standing up, jumping around a little bit. I was in the bun for too long. I'm freezing. It's around 46 degrees outside. I was out there for like two hours. And in Houston, we're not used to that weather. I've been sitting in my car for like 10 minutes trying to warm up. Right now, I'm just going to go home, eat. I'm just going to wait it out until midnight, wait for the first emails to come in. What's good, everybody? I just took a fat nap, and now I am meeting up with my friend at the mall. We're gonna go Christmas shopping, buy some other things, just to kill time before midnight. And actually, he's already here. I just wanna add, I'm really nervous right now, but it's crazy, like, it's not like a nervousness to where I'm shaking. It's really subtle. It's like in my stomach, just sitting there. It's just building inside me, but it's slowly getting worse and worse. So hopefully going Christmas shopping will help ease that nervousness. All right, so we just got done shopping. As you can see, we were leaving with nothing. All we did was buy pizza. So, you know, it is what it is, but it's around 9 p.m. over here. We're about to go back to my house and just wait it out till midnight. All right, now it's 11 p.m. This is not a drill, it is one hour before acceptance day for 2020. Right now, the nervousness is just building up. Earlier today, it was really subtle, but right now I'm just really, I'm just really excited. The two out of state schools that I got interviewed at was University of Missouri, Kansas City, and New England College of Dental Medicine. It's 11, 12, so I'm just checking to see if any status changed. And so far, no, still just says invited for interview and application complete. All right, y'all, it's one minute till midnight. I'm about to check my email right now for the first time. Okay. Still 11.59. Let me just keep refreshing over and over. Again, I know Texas schools, they email at midnight. So this is it right here. Now it's midnight, so I remember in my interview they said to give it a couple minutes, so it'll probably be like 12.03 before the email sends. So. This is like the longest moment of my life right now. It's 12.01, haven't, haven't got an email, but we're, I'm just gonna keep waiting. <gasps> Let's oh. go! <laughs> yes! Which school? Houston. Okay, 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 okay. Let's go! I got my number one school, bro. Bro, this is so crazy. Oh my God. 12.01 a.m., bro. <laughs> I can't believe this. I cannot believe this. Bro, I'm going to be a dentist, bro. Didn't I tell you? I'm going to be a dentist, bro. I told you. I haven't got an email from A&M yet. You have or haven't? Haven't. Just 
give it a minute. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a minute. Oh my gosh. Oh, I gotta tweak this. <laughs> the heart pounding, huh? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, I just got into dental school, bro. What? I told you. I just got into dental school, bro. I told you. I haven't heard nothing from A and M. Maybe they just a little late, you know. You know. Let me check my group me. Sometimes emails fall into the spam folder. You could check that. Oh, that's true. No, I don't got nothing in the junk. Nothing. Yeah, I haven't got anything from A&M. Okay, so it's 12.08. So far, I got my number one school of choice, UT Health Houston School of Dentistry. They sent me an acceptance at 12.01 a.m. I haven't heard anything from Texas A&M, so it's safe to assume I got waitlisted, but you know, I still have a whole day to receive that email. Now I just gotta wait till the morning because I know that's when the out-of-state schools will be calling. So we'll see what happens then. Right now, I'm really just waiting till 4 a.m. because I heard that's when Texas A&M will actually send their email. So I'm gonna wait for that. And then at 4.30, I should be receiving a call from University of Missouri, Kansas City to see if I was accepted or rejected. So right now I'm probably just gonna stay up till that time. And the only other school that I should be expecting a call from is New England at 9 a.m. Right now, we're just going to wait it out and see what happens. This was the email that confirmed that I will be a dentist in the next four years. My first email was from UT Health Houston. This was my number one school and really close with A&M too. So I'm going to see what A&M's email is looking like and go from there. When I first got that email, I was just shaking. Right now, I'm still shaking. I'm just really excited. I don't even know what other schools are going to accept me, but I'm just, I'm okay with this one. It's just this feeling like all this weight just left my shoulders. I just know all the hard work I put in, it finally paid off. The hard work's not done too. It's only the beginning, so I'm really excited. All right, guys, it's 3.59 a.m. I didn't really go to sleep. Just waiting for this Texas A&M email to see if I got in or not. And also, you and Casey should be calling around 4.30, so we're going to see if that happens. All right, y'all, so I was just about to go to sleep, but then I got a message from a friend and she just got into A&M, so I'm about to go check my email right now and see if I got in. So I'm logging in right now. Oh, yes, sir. So it looks like I just got into Texas a and I'm not gonna lie, I'm really tired, so I'm gonna go ahead and go to sleep and I will see what school's called tomorrow with good news. So it is 9.06 in the morning and I just got the call from UMKC. I was accepted, super excited about that. Now all I'm waiting for is New England. I've read online that they start around nine, so I'm gonna give it some time and we're gonna see what they say. All right, so I just got a call from New England around 9.28 and the status on Adia hasn't changed yet but it's official all four schools that i interviewed at so far i did get accepted to later today my mom's gonna take me out to celebrate and i'm really excited right now i don't even know who i'm gonna pick really just because these are all great schools new england just sent their email all right everyone today is january 11th 2021 and it's actually three to four weeks after decision day back on december 15th 2020. the major thing that happened was i accepted my offer from uc health houston school of dentistry that was my number one choice coming into decision day i'm really happy with my decision and i'm ready for the hard work to start it was a pretty hard decision just considering the other schools are great too but I'm ready to put on for my city and be the best dentist I could be. Not that much happened on decision day. My mom took me out to eat and then afterwards we came home and I fell asleep for the rest of the day. So you didn't really miss much, but there were some minor changes on the idea website. I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all what it's displaying right now. I forgot to get it on video, but before it said offered, received or something along those lines, but I just declined both schools. So now it says offer declined. Louisville emailed me something saying for me to reply to the email if I want my application to still be in their system. And I did not reply to their email, so they also changed their status to 
withdrew before action. That's pretty much it for this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you so much for tuning in. I hope to see y'all next time. Albert, is there anything you want to tell the people watching? Uh, no, no, not really, no.